Okay, let's start the video. As I'll be doing another video after this, but this is a Mega Man. I'll do a power separate and maybe pick three also. And again, thanks for keeping me those winning tickets. These past winning tickets. Win them for that. This draw was 3, 19, 24, 44, 50, and 8. Player caught 8, 2, 3, 4, 5 times, and caught 3, 2 times, and they caught 44. So, congratulations to the player. And uh, on this ticket, it matches 7, 53, and 61. Almost 4 to 5 numbers match. So, congratulations. And keep updating you guys. And on this ticket, let's enlarge it. Somehow it got froze a little bit. So let's see if I can enlarge it. Let's wait a little bit longer because somehow it froze now. Now I got it. It's still a little bit frozen. I don't know why. Okay, the win number was 20, 43, 51, 55, 57, and 4. So once again, they like to do three numbers in one. Group. So the, the three number in round group was 51, 55, 57. And lately, like I said, they will do three numbers in a single digit once in a while. So they did it a couple of times, either for Mega Man or Power, Powerball or for both. They did one for each or I don't remember, but you can go back to the drawing. You will see that three first number from zero, from zero one to ten has been drawn. For a uh, for one draw or two for either game or for for both or for both game, so and if you look at the wing number, you can see that the four was predicted four times, six times one two three four five six twenty twenty came twenty two and then forty two came forty three and then. Almost three to four number in this line, and then over here also, the uh, twenty predicted forty two came forty three, and fifty one and sixty one came fifty one. So this one was almost four to five number. Also, as you can see, how close it got, and this one player almost hit six numbers. Number that came was two, six, eighteen, thirty six, thirty seven, twenty one. As you can see. Like I said, they would join it once in a while. They would join it. They would join it once in a while. Once in a blue moon, they won't join it every single time. So try not to play first invisible number. Uh, he, he, but he did match to two, the six, eighteen, thirty-seven, and twenty-one. The three came thirty-six. So close, close to six number, close to retiring. So again, he got close to retiring. And uh, let's remind everybody the winning numbers for the uh. For the draw, so the win number that came last draw was 11, 15, 37, 62, and 64. There's no three numbers in one group. There are two numbers in one group 11, 15, 62, 64. And the three number I was talking about that was in one group was the draw before 223rd, 5, 7, 9. So they were focusing. On three first invisible, so chances of if you don't see any first invisible for a long time, three number in one group for a long time for the f first ten numbers, probably want to do it, take take your chance and go for that range because they did it five seven nine. Not only were they five seven nine, they were all odd numbers except for twenty, and there were four low numbers except for fifty seven. So now for the draw before. 
no odds and even no low or high. You can see that that and. And the Mega Man. We'll be using the Mega Man. So again, we're talking about the Mega Man for 327. Uh, 301. Two three zero seven. So, but before we get started, you can email me if you want to learn my system. It goes from part one to part twenty. So let's update twenty eighteen nineteen and twenty. So. I don't want to block my hand, probably will block it. And you can donate, subscribe, share, or like my video. And email me for any game prediction at hyper underscore links at yahoo.com. So, so again, always trust yourself. Now, let's, let's really get started. On the teaser for... For Mega Man 307, 302 to 307, actually, because the Mega Man starts tomorrow. And the winning numbers for last draw was 11. You can see 11. If we, if we was 11, it was on the bottom. 43 over here. So this is decent number one. If you were to use the last winning number for this week's teaser, number one. You can do that. It is the number one. And you can see 1134. Not 34, 11, 15. 15, not, not 34. I was, I was looking at the wrong uh, winning numbers. 11, 15, 37, 37, not in the teaser. 62 on the bottom. Quadrant 3 also in quadrant 4. And 64, 64, not in the D, sir. Trying to squeeze 64 in. And 05, 05 on the bottom. So if you were to use the last win number on, on, on this D, sir, you will have four win numbers. Now, you might want to need, you might want to think about the blue box. Just in case, just in case you want to use this D, sir, for, uh, uh, the next two drives for Mega Man and Powerball. This is for Mega Man Powerball. Just in case. And you can see that this teaser might give pull you a good winning hand. And uh, let's take a look at the highest frequency number in the uh, in the teaser. Let's highest. Sorry about that. Let's talk about some of the highest frequency in the deezer. So, if you look at one of the highest frequency in the deezer, we can see 42, one time, two time, three time, four time, five time. 42, 24 is five times. So again, 24, 42 is five times. And we also have you can see we also have the four aligned with the forty eight. So 
48 one time, 48 two time, 48 three times. So 48 appears three times. You can add that to a, to a highest frequency number for uh, to be used for Mega Man or Powerball. So again, another highest frequency number you can look at, I would say, is 26, 62, one time, two times, three times, four times. So 26, 62 will be four times. You can see those numbers appearing four times in DZ number one. So again, you might want to think about that. This is DZ number two. I'm going to post two DZ up for the uh, Mega Man Powerball. You might want to think about the blue box as well. So again, ignore the old number. I've got to scratch it off. So again, these are number two. And if you were to use last winning number, you would still see 11 on the bottom. So 11, it would still be on the bottom. 15 would still be on the bottom. Now, it would be on the bottom. Before also, it was on the bottom. I, I, I could admit 15 on the bottom on these are before, but I did it on top. So 15 on the bottom, let's do it on the bottom this time. 37, uh, right side. Uh, okay, 62 uh, on the top. Quadrant two. 64, not in the deezer. And 05, 05 on the bottom, also quadrant four. So this deezer did better than the deezer before. If we were to use the winning number from last show into this teaser, five winning number, I can, you can see. Now, let's name some of the highest frequency number in this teaser before we, we go. So, highest frequency number in this teaser. Uh, let's look at that. You can see on the bottom, you can see the, the zeros. Only appearing two times, but the eight appearing a lot of times. So you can use that eight as an advantage. And even with the eight as an advantage, you only see, I would say 18. Yeah, 18. One time, two times, three times, four times, five times, six times. So 18 appearing six times. I want to think about that for either game. If you're using these number two. Uh, how about, don't really see other highest frequency number in the deezer. I really don't know which one. I'm trying to look at it. Oh, 38. 38 one time, 38 two times, 38 three times. 38 three times. And 39, one time, two times, three times. So 38 and 39 appear three times. You might want to think about that. 38, 39 appearing three times. And so far, I haven't seen any highest frequency number besides 38 and 39. Now, what about... Uh, don't think there's any highest frequency number in this besides those two. That's really obvious. So let's not stretch our brain out. Just focus on these three, so you don't got that much high frequency numbers for tomorrow's draw or Wednesday's draw. And I'll be doing a lot of pool. If you want to be in the pool, you can email me for a pool also. Doing a lot of pool also. And now, the invisible number goes by this. You have first, second, third, fourth, fifth invisible, and the Megaball invisible number, and the invisible pairs. So then you have Post invisible number. So, you want to post invisible number? You can email me for post invisible number. Also, post invisible number and invisible numbers are different. So, you can email me for any of those games. And the last draw. Let's look at last draw's winning number. So, we have 11, 15, 37, 62. 
64 and 05 so and And if you look at the winning number, 11, 15, 37, 62, and 64, and 05, you really will see that the code will be in the middle. So for last draw, I didn't really check, but let's say the last draw to code was, let's say the code was 62. For instance, let's say the last draw to code was 62. Just for instance, I didn't check it. You would need to have the right pairing up here, 1115, I'll keep 33, 37, and I have 64. So imagine your code was 62 last draw. You have these five pentagon pair numbers plus the code. So the winning combination that will get you the jackpot, there are three winning combinations that will get you the jackpot. Three pairs that will get you $1 million and have a chance to get you the jackpot. The three groups of pairs. Uh, 1115 and 3764 37, and then you have the code for 62 this is one of the combination that will get you the jackpot because the code will be matrix on most of the lines so another combination that will get you the jackpot is 11 37 15 64 11, 64, 15, 37. These are the three groups that will get you the jackpot. So three groups of pairs, even though it's the same number, you play it with a different mega ball, mega ball. So again, so even if you have that, and it comes up to three same groups of numbers, when you pair up those three groups of pairs, you plus the code, you have three groups of same numbers. That's okay because you can hit one man more than once. You just pair a different mega ball for that. So, for instance, I will pair me mega ball number one for this, and then for the next one, I'll pair up mega ball five. Then for the third one, I'll pair up mega ball nine. So you have three different pairings of mega ball. That means your each of your combination will be different because you're pairing up with a different mega ball. So again, that's why the pentagon pair system is good. So. You can choose to use this system as well. And as you can see, like I said, five, seven, nine. They, they throw out that they will throw out that once in the blue moon. And for the last four draws, you really haven't seen any any number range with three numbers in the same group. Except five, seven, and nine. So again, guarantee you they won't do that for a long time. That group pairing for 1 to 10 they won't throw up three numbers in 1 to 10 for a long time if they do it'll be rare so you won't see that i promise you that you won't see that so try not to pick numbers in the first number we have, we have at least three numbers in 1 to 10 do not do that and you know they're controlling the game so whatever you play they'll run you over because the computer is set up To block your numbers so when they whenever they want to you know you can notice that the holiday they've been holding jackpot now they now the holiday is over they've been giving out jackpot so fast you can see that you can see that it's just not that it, it's not only for this year it's for last year the previous year before and then the previous year they've been holding jackpot very high for the holiday you can see how they're controlling the game 
to boot bump up the cell. So again, but they, but if they don't know which system you're using, what number you're playing, somebody gotta win. So if you have a good system, you're gonna win that jackpot. So, so if you like any game prediction, you can email me at hyper underscore links at yahoo.com. And uh, please do donate, subscribe, share, and like the video. And if you want to know my system, please email me also.